In the diagram below, which letter best describes meiosis? So we can see in each diagram, we're starting out with a cell that either is diploid or is haploid. And we can automatically scratch this one out because both mitosis and meiosis start out with a diploid cell. This one here only having N is a haploid cell, so that means F can't be our answer. Remember that 2N is diploid, while 1N, or just regular N, is haploid. And this just basically means how much DNA is in that cell or how many chromosomes are in that cell. The next thing we can do is we can cross off any letter or any diagram that doesn't have two rounds of division. So you can see like this diagram of B only has one round of division. So that is not our answer. Same with D and same with G. Since we're talking about meiosis, we're going through two rounds of division. So we're left with A, C, and E. Now this is where it kind of gets hard. During meiosis, our first round of meiosis is going to split the cell and create two haploid cells. Then the second round is going to take those haploid cells and split them again, but they're also going to be haploid. So if we look at our answers, we can see C in the first round of division, they're still diploid. So C is not our answer. E, our first set of cells is diploid, so this is not our answer. This means A is the right choice since the first round of division creates two haploid cells, and the second round of division also creates two more haploid cells, which means there's four haploid cells at the end. 